Hello everyone, this is Michael from the Banterweight Boxing YouTube channel. As you can see, I'm on my own today. I've been ditched by the brothers, but I thought I'd make a quick little video. So in the boxing world, there has been a lot of talk about Evander Holyfield fighting uh, Vitor Belfort. And uh, recently some uh, training footage has just surfaced. And I thought I'd give it a watch, but rather than just watch it on my own, I'd do a live reaction to it so you guys can see what I think of it. Um, just before we get into it, I'm not expecting much. Um, I think I'm going to be slightly disappointed um, and slightly worried, I think, uh, going into this fight. But I thought, I'd get, considering the reaction was so bad, I was like, all right, I've got to give this a look. But anyway, uh, I've got two screens going. So Techie Mike has come out um, for like a proper IT IT guy right now. Uh, but let's let's give it a watch. Shout out to um, Seconds Out as well because I'm using their using their content to, to watch this. So here we go, we're on the pads. Now let's bear in mind, it's not too difficult to look good on pads. I think even I can look fairly decent on pads, but we're off. Um, yeah, straight off the bat is pretty slow, pretty slow. Looks like we're fighting in slow motion right now or kind of underwater, <laughs> it's a bit, but okay. Okay, I'll bear with him, I'll bear with him. We're warming up, we're warming up. Yeah, yeah. He's got the comp combinations going. He's, which is which is something. He's missing the pads quite a lot. Um, yeah, it just doesn't really look like the mind muscle connection is quite there. I think he knows what he wants to do, but he's going to throw a shot and just completely missing the pad, or or the trainer is telling him to throw a certain shot and he's they have to redo it or whatever. The reactions just aren't there. Like you can tell, the the trainer's telling him to you know hit a shot there, putting it out, and he's he's like on a little time delay. He's like looking at it and then froze, which uh, <laughs> going into a boxing match is probably not the best thing because uh, your reactions have got to be be on point. Yeah, he looks shattered. He looks shattered. I've been watching for a good. It's only been about thirty seconds or so, and he looks like he can take the stool right now. So, um, yeah, not good, not not too good. Um, they've just finished doing the, the pads. I think I think by the looks of it, he's gonna go on to do some um, some uh, shadow boxing in a second, which again, I think he'll he might look a little bit better in the shadow boxing. It's quite quite difficult to look bad. But while we're waiting for him to start that, I just thought, well, we could do talk a little bit about um, the actual fight coming up. So, He's fighting Vitor Belfort. Belfort, I probably butchered that already. Um, but I don't know too much about him. I know he's 44 um, and he's a former UFC fighter, a very accomplished UFC fighter actually. Um, but the big factor in that is the age because Evander Holyfield now is 58, I wanna say, 58. I think he's about to turn 60, yeah, that sounds about right. And 44 to to 58 is a big age gap, especially in a sporting world. Um, and I know Belfort can can um, crack. So it's slightly worrying for him. I think a lot of the boxing fans have been saying this. They're just very worried about, about this going into the fight. Um, and it's just a bit sad, really. Um, because obviously, Holyfield needs a, um, needs a payday, which is a bit of a shame. But uh, yeah, I don't think any of us want to see this. I don't know who who are the people who pay the pay per view for this. Like genuinely, I, I want to meet these people. Like it's so random. Like um, yeah, I will not be tuning into this. But I thought I'd give the uh, the sparring footage a chance just in case you know Holyfield was on some crazy crazy substances and then just looked like he was uh, twenty five or twenty six. But um, no, it's not the case. Uh, yeah. Hopefully he's all right and nothing bad happens to him in this fight um, and they get paid. That's the main thing. They get paid a lot of money. So, uh, yeah. Well, best of luck to them. But I don't think there's anything else I really need to see here. I'm watching the, the shadow boxing and, uh, yeah, he just looks rocky. He just looks like every time he throws a shot, he looks completely out of balance. Um, it's very unorthodox, but we'll see. Anyway, thank you for watching. That's my live reaction to Evander Holyfield spot, um, training footage. Um yeah, we'll be back soon with a podcast. And also, make sure you like and subscribe. Click those buttons. I don't know what they do, but just do it. Because everyone else says to do it. And I forgot to say it on uh, the last podcast. But we will be, yeah, we will be back soon 
with another podcast uh, with big fights coming up with AJ and Usyk. So stay tuned. Thank you and goodbye.